today we got ourselves a big video because I'm going to finally be doing something that I have been wanting to do for a while because we gotta start getting ready for those future Galaxy Opals and Dark Matter players that 2K is going to be releasing this year in NBA 2K21, my team. As you know right now, 2K is already releasing Pink Diamonds in September, so we need a ton of MT and that's exactly what we're gonna be doing in this video. We're gonna be getting a ton of it. We're gonna have so much MT. Actually, we're gonna have so much that I wanna do a giveaway right now. So if you guys do wanna win either a gift card or MT, I need you to leave a like on the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and let me know down below in the comments right now what you are currently doing in 2K, whether it's 2K21, maybe you're playing 2K20, you're playing Park, you're playing my team, just let me know down below, and also include your Twitter and Instagram, that way I can privately message you, and like I said, today we got ourselves a big video, because this right here is going to be the first step in getting ready for future Galaxy Opals and Dark Matter players in my team, and obviously we're going to be getting a lot of MT, and before I do show you guys how I ended up making my MT, I'm going to show you how you can make MT right right now in my team in case you are trying to get MT in 2K21 and so the way that you do it is you always want to look out for those challenges and that experience that you do get this year in the seasons and basically you want to go for those rubies those rubies always have value it's happened with Kenny the Jet Smith it's happened with Ray Allen it's happened with almost every single ruby that 2K has released you want to buy them for like under 2,000 MT maybe go a little higher 3,000 depending how much they're going for and I ended up doing that with Kenny the Jet Smith I was getting him for like 2,000 sometimes 3,000 and sometimes cheaper you always want to get them as cheap as you can and I was selling them for about like 7,000 to 8,000 MT so just keep that in mind that's a really good way to make MT at the moment and that of course you know you can do that as much as you can as long as you're sniping in the auction house and you do want to be fast because the rubies do end up dropping in value pretty quickly so just keep that you know as a nice little way to make MT right now in NBA 2K21 my team however though today we have a different kind of video because I'm going to show you guys how I ended up making a ton of MT and you should already know you've been watching my videos you know we've been doing a lot of stuff and without further ado let's get right into it so right here you see the auction outcomes it says completed 50 but guess what though it's a lot more than 50 I, I can guarantee you that and we're gonna redeem all the MT today look at all these oh my goodness I have been saving all of these players that I ended up pulling sniping and basically just getting from free packs you know pack openings and stuff like that the auction house every which way and we're finally gonna be redeeming every little bit of MT and by the way, I do want to tell you guys that I messed up right here. Uh, let me see if I can find it. I was streaming and I was putting up these cards for 21,000. And um, yeah, I put one for 2,100. So whoops, my bad. You got to be careful. This is the first time in, in any year of 2K that I actually, actually ended up accidentally putting up a card for like, you know, super cheap. So my bad, but it happens to the best of us. But without further ado, it is now time to redeem all the MT. So if you're ready, I'm ready. Without further ado, let's get right into it. One, two, and three, bam. So that's gonna be 20K. If you do see some players sell for a lot of MT, it's because I sold them early on. Some of them might've gone up in price like that Gus definitely went up in price another ruby that i'm telling you is valuable like a lot of the rubies this year in 2k have a ton of value we saw porzingis for 5,000. we had a lot of porzingis from our pack openings from our free packs and you always want to go into the season and you want to see what players are needed for certain challenges and then that way you can take advantage of it in the auction house buy them low sell them high you can make a ton of empty especially with everybody opening packs you'd be surprised a lot of people do open packs not just youtubers not just content creators people do in general open packs and they do get free packs from logic codes you know from challenges and stuff like that and look at all these bill waltons that i got oh my goodness that empty is gonna start adding up we're already at 200 000 mt and then ben simmons we got tony allen over here another ruby we got dennis johnson which i accidentally you know sold for like you know a lot cheaper than i probably should have but it's okay though we got a ton of mt and definitely go for those rubies like i said you can make a ton of mt with the rubies uh, you can do it with any ruby that comes out as long as it has a challenge if it has a challenge it's gonna have value we got 300k already right here tony allen selling for 3k i pulled this nick if you guys remember probably one of our better pack openings we pulled him and he sold for 69,000 mt Yo, we're gonna be big ballers over here. Hey, you love to see it. We got James Harden over here. I think he was from a guaranteed Amethyst pack that I got from the Ascension board. We got Damian Lillard. We got Luca over here. Luca was actually going for a lot more. And look at Richard Hamilton. This card, I think he's even more expensive now because people want to get him right now for the experience because he's no longer pullable. So I sold him for 4,000 MT, but I think now you can get a lot more. And during this time, you could probably get him for like 500, 1,000, and then obviously sell it for a ton more. So keep that in mind. Same with Ray Allen. Like, I sold that Ray Allen quick, but now I kind of wish I would have saved him because, like, he's definitely going for a lot more MT, too. We got Robert Ori right here. Some of these are obviously from packs. 
you know most of these are from packs though because you guys see all the pack openings we've been doing but i also do get free packs from logger codes domination stuff like that and then obviously working the auction house from time to time when i'm not doing videos i'm definitely trying to work the market here and there not as much as i used to i definitely don't work the market as much and uh, marco did not sell a hey, marco polo over here but a ton of other mt that we got to redeem still oh my goodness and uh, i've been trying to work the auction house obviously there is still you know that auction house glitch that i think 2k is doing purposely at this point to stop people from sniping uh, i'm sure you guys have experienced it where you go into the market and you like it always says another user has bought it and it's been up for like at least 30 minutes and stuff like that so hopefully they fix that too and i feel like they've been doing a lot of stuff like that just to prevent people from sniping and that's one of the reasons why i haven't even brought back sniper story because it does you know sometimes it's just uh it's just annoying more than anything to try to uh snipe in the auction house but uh there definitely is ways to make mt you just got to be consistent you got to be wanting to get the cards and uh, hopefully 2k does fix it because that's one of the things that 2k needs to fix right now but we got some more mt right here another robert ori we got tatum we got another tatum that did not sell i think i sold him during the uh the challenges same with jimmy butler towns had value at some point Jokic had value joel Embiid, obviously that damian lillard i feel like every other day is getting a new challenge and he's always expensive he goes down and then he goes up and then he goes down up down up down every which way and then we got a luca yo future mvp you already know we got my boy shay we got a kevin durant which we also ended up getting from a free amethyst pack from the ascension board so there definitely is a way to make mt this year without just spending money now obviously most of this stuff is from the mt that i got from like spending money but some of it obviously is from the free packs we got porzingis we got another porzingis and look at this kenny sold them for eight thousand i show you guys the clips i was getting them for like three thousand two thousand i ended up selling them some of them i did sell from the packs that i got and then uh, some of them did not sell because the price definitely did end up tanking i got a little too greedy some of these i sold for a little bit more but i have a feeling he might be worth a little bit more now that the packs are gone so it might be a blessing in disguise and uh, we're already gonna be at 600 000 mt oh my goodness dude i cannot wait until they drop that first galaxy opal because i know it's coming soon they're 97 and 98 overalls now and so pink diamonds we're already getting them in september so you never know galaxy opal could come out in two weeks three weeks who knows maybe even sooner even though there is already a galaxy opal available which is uh, the elgin baylor that you can evolve to a galaxy opal and then we got ourselves some more iggy's we got some more kenny's you see he low he slowly like dropped in value he was eight thousand then he dropped to six thousand that's why you always want to get him for like two thousand or below and this works with any ruby like i said earlier that is gonna have um value because of challenges experience and stuff like that so we're gonna keep redeeming we still got over 50 to redeem oh my goodness lebron's over 50k i forgot how i got that lebron i think that might have been from the ascension board too i've been getting very lucky with some of these guaranteed amethyst packs and uh look at all this mt though oh my goodness Kyrie, we got bam we got ben simmons we got everything you could ask for and it's all adding up oh my goodness I'm, i might have to i might have to give away more mt than i originally planned because my goodness look at all this mt yo i might uh, wow well, i was hoping to have 500k but uh <laughs> clearly we're gonna be having way more than 500k because we haven't even got into the big value players that i ended up selling after the previous uh, pack opening that i did if you guys saw that video you know exactly how lucky we got in that pack opening and look at all these patty mills though 3k that's easy mt man you get them for 500 a thousand everybody's quick selling them everybody's just throwing them up in the auctions for super cheap and guess what you gotta be there and you gotta sell them you gotta buy them for the low low and then sell them very very high as long as they have value right away the most value you'll get is the first day the first hour the first few hours that they come out so keep that in mind too and look at all this MT. Oh my goodness, there were big ballers over here. Porzingis did not sell, but it's fine though. We'll send him to the auction house. This one sold for 64,000 MT. A lot of these patty mills I did end up pulling. Some of them I did buy for like 500, 1,000, but only very few. Like I wasn't really doing too many, too much sniping because I knew I already had all this MT, you know, lined up for me. And so uh, this is all the results of all the MT. Look at all this. Oh my goodness, bro. <laughs> Dude, this is crazy another porzingis for 64,000 mt we got a luca we got a lillard i kind of wish i would have saved that lillard because he ended up going up in value like i said he got another challenge and it's crazy we're about to be at a million we're really about to be at one million mt are you guys ready look, look, this, this is monumental this this is the first time in 2k21 that i'm going to have one million mt one two and three and just like that we're at one million actually we're not at one million we're over one million so not only did we get to a million we got over a million and then guess what we still got way more 
MT on the way and then some uh, you know scholars did not sell that's fine that's a-okay and uh, we're basically hey look at all oh my god even that contract's got value bro everything in the beginning of 2k has a ton of value and uh we might have a lot more MT than I uh, expected my goodness we got some more Alonzo mornings that we sold some more scholars look at all this MT oh my goodness we got another poor thing is we still got to sell he ended up you know dropping in price unfortunately but it happens Alonzo morning dude we're at 1.3 million Dude, we might be at 2 million. Yo, dude. I'm so I'm so happy that I waited because like I wanted to have a big amount so that way we can make it into a big video and get ready again for those Galaxy Opo and Dark Matter players that we'll be getting this year. And then we got another poor Zingas we got to sell. And we got 10 more items. So it's going to redeem them all. It's going to be Scola. It's going to be Patty Mills. It's going to be a coach. Look at this Mike Malone. Pulled him, sold him for 8,000 MT. Not too bad. And look at all this MT and BAM! We're done and we have exactly 1.4 million MT! Are you serious? I kind of want to get to 1.5 million now. Yo, I mean, I do still have, you saw those Porzingis. I could sell those Porzingis. How much is he going for? I might actually sell it because, uh, you know. And like I said, I am going to give away some MT. If you want to win the MT or you want to win a gift card, all you have to do is leave a like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And also include your Twitter and Instagram and tell me what you're doing in 2K right now. But this Porzingis, I think, is still... Oh, he might have dropped a little bit more. Oh, no. Yo, I think I'm going to sell him, though. Yeah, he's like 40k now. The thing is, though, I can't tell if it's glitched or if it's not glitched. And you know what? I'm going to save the Porzingis. I'll go ahead and sell him later. But right now, though, we got 1.4 million MT, which means that we are ready for anything that 2K wants to release in the future, whether it's a Dark Matter player, a Galaxy Opal, maybe even another Pink Diamond in September. You never know with 2K, because right now, they are dropping a ton of content, challenges, experience, logger codes, packs, and all that good stuff. So we got a ton to do, and we are ready with 1.4 million MT. So definitely stay tuned for shopping sprees. Stay tuned for more pack openings. Stay tuned for more videos and all that good stuff But that right there is going to be the video We got 1.4 million MT to mess around with in the future And if you guys did enjoy the video And you want to win some free MT or a free gift card Then leave a like right now on the video Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already Let me know down below in the comments right now What you are doing in 2K Whether it's 2K21, 2K20, maybe even 2K19 Just let me know down below and include your Twitter and Instagram as well But that right there is going to be the video 1.4 million MT Big baller Carlos, you already know, we're back, we're officially ready for any future content, and that is just going to be the video. Make sure to check out these three other videos that I uploaded. I ended up completing every single collection for my new Gold Squad, really good video, go check it out. Check out the pack opening that we did recently, which was our best one, which helped make this video possible with all the MT we made from that pack opening. And then check out this other amazing video, and as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Yeah, Roses in my wallet and I'm flexing it for real. Racks and racks and racks, I look like rookie of the year.